Hi, I'm Mitch Gallagher from Sweetwater. This time out, I know a lot of you are going to be excited because we're going to check out the latest version of one of the most popular families of audio interfaces ever created. Let's get started. Today we're looking at the Focusrite Scarlet family, and this is Generation 4, the latest version of that family of audio interfaces. I've got the Scarlet Generation 4 Solo, I've got the 2i2 and the 4i4, and we'll be digging into those a little bit later. Now Focusrite tells us that the Scarlet family was launched around 2010, and there are more than 6 million users of the Scarlet family out there, so it's incredibly popular. And that's a tribute to the fact that it's super easy to use, so if you're just getting into recording, it makes a great choice, but it also has great sound quality and great features so even if you're a full-on pro you can still put this to work in your rig for portable applications as a grab-and-go interface or just to have as an extra interface in your computer bag it makes a great supplement to everything that you're doing but it also serves equally well as a centerpiece for a studio now with the generation 4 Focusrite has really upped the ante there are some big changes with these new audio interfaces and it will make them ideal whether you're live streaming recording music if you're a singer songwriter they can serve a lot of different applications and again those new features that are in the generation 4 are going to up the ante even further we'll begin by taking a quick look at these three interfaces then we'll talk about the new features now on top of the stack here, we have the Scarlett Solo G4. This has a single microphone and a single instrument level input, has a headphone output, we have stereo monitor outs, and this can be bus powered from your Mac, your PC, or from an iPad Pro. In the middle, we have the interface that you're actually hearing in this video, and that's the Scarlett 2i2 Generation 4. With this interface, we have two mic line or instrument level inputs. We also have a headphone output, stereo monitor outs. The Scarlett 2i2 can be powered using either bus power or it'll operate off a 5 volt adapter. Rounding things out, we have the Scarlett 4i4 G4. Now this has two mic line or instrument level inputs. You can see those here on the front panel. We also have two line inputs on the back panel for a total of four simultaneous inputs. It has four line outputs on the back panel and it does include an adapter for powering it. All three interfaces are compatible with Mac, Windows, and iPad Pro, as I mentioned, and they include nice features such as direct monitoring. There's a switch here on the Solo, for example. Direct monitoring allows you to hear what's coming into the interface, so you don't have any latency issues when you're overdubbing. We have our traditional Scarlett Halo level indicators that surround the gain controls on each of the channels, so you can see at a glance where your levels are at. One of the great new features with the Scarlett family is the ultra-low distortion outputs. This makes them incredibly clean for driving your monitors. Speaking of monitoring, we also have a custom designed headphone output on each of these interfaces that's designed to drive pretty much any headphone from consumer to pro. Well, let's take a close look at the new features in the Scarlett family. There's some big news here, and topping that list is the fact that we have totally new converters in the 2i2 and the 4i4, and in fact, these are the same converters that Focusrite uses in their flagship RedNet interfaces. We have up to 120 dB measured dynamic range, which is extremely wide, and resolution support up to 24-bit 192 kilohertz. We have a completely redesigned air mode. Now, air mode, there's a switch here on the front panel that engages that for the inputs. Air mode emulates the sound of the iconic Focusrite consoles. It gives it a nice open airiness, a nice presence. There's a distinct change when you engage that, and with the redesigned air effect, it sounds even better. On the 2i2 and the 4i4, we also have redesigned mic preamps. Now, these are fourth generation preamps that offer up to 69 dB of gain. We have phantom power of course and a really nice feature on the 2i2 and the 4i4 is the auto gain set. Just engage auto gain set, send audio in for 10 seconds and it'll automatically set your gain control to an optimal setting. It's like having an engineer setting the input level for you. Another new feature that's very valuable is Clip Safe. This is especially important if you're working by yourself because with Clip Safe, the interface is checking the audio levels up to 96,000 times a second and making sure that those audio levels don't move into overload or to clipping. If it does, it'll automatically adjust the gain level before that happens. So it's a way to ensure that you can basically set things up and kind of forget about them as you're recording. A single peak or a loud noise or something is not going to cause that to go into clipping. Very cool feature. The Scarlett Generation 4 interfaces also include an incredible bundle of software to get you started right out of the box. You get Pro Tools Artist. You get Ableton Live Lite. You can see I'm recording in Ableton right now. You get a membership to Splice so you can download loops and samples. You get an incredible array of virtual instruments, virtual guitar and bass amps, plugins, all sorts of content is included to get you making music as soon as you pop the box open. And speaking of getting started, it couldn't be easier with the Generation 4 Scarlett interfaces. They come with a personalized quick start tool that gets you up and running almost instantly. 
One more thing I want to mention, and that's that the Scarlett interfaces are available as studio bundles as well. With the Studio Bundle, you get the CM25 Mark III condenser microphone, which you've been hearing in this video. It comes with a mic mount. It comes with a mic cable. It comes with the USB cable for connecting to your computer. It also includes a set of Studio headphones, and it even includes a cardboard template that you can cut and fold to make an instant microphone stand. So really, everything you need to get started is in the Studio Bundles with the Scarlett interfaces. I hope you've enjoyed this quick look at the Scarlett Generation 4 audio interfaces. Super excited about these. I mean, the Scarlett interfaces have been so great for, what, 14 years now. And with the new Generation 4, that's only going to continue. They've really upped the ante with those new converters. They sound fantastic. Clip safe, auto gain set. These are features that are so useful in the studio. You're going to love these interfaces. You definitely want to check them out. And speaking of, head over to Sweetwater.com to check the product pages to learn all about these interfaces. And for complete information, contact your Sweetwater sales engineer. They'll be happy to help you zero in on exactly the right Scarlet interface for your application and your needs. Thanks for joining me today. I'm Mitch Gallagher from Sweetwater.